Hi everyone. Welcome to Linda's Thrifty Life. I am finally going to attempt this um, swap and glue with my new camera stand and I hope that it works. I think I've got it lined up pretty well. So let me share with you the first um, thing I received from Mimi with Love, which is a Melissa, and she sent a card. I'm hoping this is not upside down. <laughs> you won't see it if it is. <laughs> I'll, I'll have to redo it. But um, we had agreed to do the swap, <clears throat> and I have hers ready to send. I have been so far behind, but thank you so much. <clears throat> so she sent me, look at these three little um, playing cards. How cute are they? Okay, I'm, I hope I'm, I'm going to try to make it centered here. But these are so cute. <clears throat> so, I mean, this little baby doll cut out. A couple of napkins. A little piece of pretty vellum. A really plain um, postcard. So many things could be done with that. A page out of a bird book. I love the I love the illustrations. And then here are some of the pages she sent me. I really love that. Look at all of these. Some have stuff that I would use on the back. Some just seem more one-sided. These are great words that you could use. That's really pretty. But I really like that. I have looked through these because I have tried to film this several times. <laughs> This is, this is a learning curve here. That's a great picture. The black and white. Okay. That's sculpture. Ooh, I like that picture of the city with all the cars and stuff. I'm trying to make sure I get it centered. I like that. The boy had to sit still long enough for the artist to paint his picture, but it wasn't easy. Doesn't he look as if he could just wait to go out and play? That must not refer to this picture. <laughs> Never mind. But anyway, maybe it is. Uh, an artist paints. She sent me some bride pictures. Look how pretty, pretty, pretty. And there's another bride. This is like some bride makeup or I don't know what this, but lots of interesting pictures. This is really pretty. An overhead airport review, it says at the top. Oh, and some planes. More airplanes. A little page that I could color. I wonder if I'm showing everything. <laughs> and this is Break the News to Mother. And what it is is some, um, it, it's some um, sheet music. How fun. And then these are the pages that I decided to, I went ahead and picked out to do my um, swap and glue. And I decided to choose, uh, th put these two cards in it because you know how much I love pink. Here I am. Oh yeah, pink girl. So I like this because of the candy and the girls are pretty and some of that background. So I chose that. This has lots of pretty pink images in it. Here, let me try. So, more pink images. I like that a lot. Look at that. That wallpaper is awesome. Pink. I forget what's that. Oh, I like that too, but I think I will probably be using the pinks. But I might have some of this on the bottom that I use. This is one of my favorite things she sent. Just, I love the water, you know, the softness of it the two girls with their doll and the other side is cute too with the uh, <laughs> horse coming through the uh, the door while they're eating but um this this picture is just says linda all over it and then i love both of these sides of this page too this girl and she's got pink on and then this couple is cute too so these are the pages i'm going to use for my swap and glue so where's my swap and glue book? Here's my book. This was the first swap and glue I did. 
with Not Too Shabby Chic. Then I've done a few others that I'll share with you in another time. But this is the double page I'm going to try to use today. So let's see. So I really want to start out with this girl. And I don't know. I just want to kind of rip a little, make it a little so it'll fit on this page. I'm not used to doing um, any kind of crafting process um, live and online. Oh, see, she's way too big for it. <laughs> Let's take that a little bit more off there. So I hope you enjoy this. I'll try not to make it too long. Alrighty, let's see. I think that's close enough. Well, I'm probably gonna cover some of this up anyway. All right, let's just let's just glue this down. Let's see. I do like using glue sticks for this project because it's not going anywhere except right here in my book. And the uh, glue sticks are fast, inexpensive, and easy, easy breezy. What is that? Easy breezy, beautiful cover girl. Well, no. There we go. We put her in there. I like that. So we'll save those scraps. We might want some more green sometime. So let's see. I'm going to save that for another one. I really love this card. I love these playing cards. Oh, I think I'll use that one. Um, I have a collection of playing cards. I just, you know, I keep one, just one of all sorts of vintage cards. I just really like them. That's just really pretty there. I'll save that one. <clears throat> save that. Let's see how I want to do this. I end up doing double page layouts because it's just, I find with the magazine photos that a lot of them are quite large, of course, and that just to do one small page, um, sometimes it's hard. You have to have a lot of smaller images or things that don't, you know, really show that much. And this is just no rhyme or reason, this one. <laughs> I'm just doing pretty, pretty things. So, cutting this, tearing this. I don't cut. I try not to cut. I like to just tear. I like the look of tearing. Oops, maybe I didn't want to tear like that. But there it is. All right, I'm going to take the white off. Right there. I'm not sure they have any relation to each other except in colors, <laughs> but that's the way, that's the way I swap and glue. <laughs> Unless I have a theme and then I'm, you know, then it's easier if you have a whole lot of um, papers, you know, you can um, hunt for papers in your theme. But this is, swap and glue is you're trying to make a, a, uh, a collage from what um, you're sent by your swap partner. And I think that is a lot of fun and a bit of a challenge, which we like challenges. Um, I have been telling people how much I have enjoyed um, collaging, that it's just, I find it very relaxing. It's kind of um, a mind a mind palette clean cleanser. That's what I'm calling it. <laughs> if that makes sense. You know, when your head gets so full of, of stuff, you know, whether it be crafty stuff and you're stymied or, um, world life stuff and you're just overwhelmed that just taking and tearing some paper and putting, um, some things on a page 
can just be, I don't know, relaxing. Because there's no right or wrong. It's just whatever you feel like doing. So, I'm going to put these words on here because I am inspired by colors. I probably, I'm going to wait, though, because I want to put something underneath that, I think. No. Let's see if we can find some more pink. <laughs> it's such a pink girl. Ooh, that's kind of pretty. Let's see what we can do with these. I'm trying to chat with you <laughs> while I do this and not make this too long. So I am kind of moving it along here. I don't um, want this to be very long. I know that it's really hard to watch long videos. We're all so busy. I just, I try to watch all of you the best I can. Um, you know, I may not get every one of your videos watched, but I try to watch as much as I can and as often as I can. Yeah, I think we'll do that. Um, and you probably do the same thing. I, you know, I have noticed that as the world seems to be opening up a little bit that some of our views are going down. It could be that I'm just getting boring. <laughs> that could very well be too, but um, I, I hope not. I hope I'm not too boring. Um, for me, this is just more about um, some shapes and colors and not really a theme except for maybe that it's pink. And, and other colors. Let's see. I don't even know what that is. Oh, that's pretty. So, um, I would love to do, I think I said in my last one, if anyone is wanting to do a, a swap and glue, just let me know. I'm, I'm hoping that um, this has been a very busy month with mom, a lot of, lot of uh, doctor's appointments for mom. About twice a year, we have just really busy, you know, we, we do like six month checkups most of the time for her with her, you know, slew of doctors she has. And, um, so, um, see, it's hard for me to, <laughs> it's hard for me to think, <laughs> rip, tear, <laughs> Do, do all of that in one thing. Yeah, you, you got it. You got it. You, you saw how, how I had to stop. My mouth went, what? What are you doing? All right, let's see. Uh, <clears throat> oh, I like that over there. That's a lot of white space. Let's see if we can put a little green in here, even though it's, yeah. Not that I have to have it all completely covered, but it is better when it's all covered. You can if you um, if you find that you you haven't um, covered everything, that you can go back in and use inks or glues or something. Um, not glues, inks or paints or something to to uh, make those white white spots go away. But because um, you can do anything you want, that is that is the whole purpose of of um, of this kind of art. It is all up to you. I think I'm even going to put that upside down. Just gonna do it. So, um, anyway. <laughs> Mom is doing better. I am so thankful for, for that. You know, she's, she's um, hanging in there pretty well right now. And um, she did really well at the pulmonary doctor. She um, did really well on her breathing test. So some of the new medication that they have given her has worked really well for her to open up her lungs a little bit. She was a smoker back, 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 back. 
And you know, she's been quit many a year, but um, it did leave some damage. And um, so, you know, there's there's just that, you know, that's just, but she's, she's doing well. And, you know, with her heart and stuff, it's, you know, it's just a balancing act of, of what's working and what's not. But right now, everything seems to be pretty good. You know, we went through a really bad spell there for a little bit, but we seem to have come back from that <clears throat> and doing pretty well. Ah! There we go. I really like that little candy cane thing too. I just want some some color, some color. And I try to rip it this way so that the white, when you rip it, you probably couldn't even see me doing that. I am all over the place. I am not used to this overhead. I don't know what you're seeing and what you're not. <laughs> to be honest, everyone, I'm so sorry. This might be the worst uh, video I've ever done. <laughs> but I'm having fun. I'm trying. <laughs> so... Let's see, I'm looking for something else pink. And kind of like that. Let's see. Yeah, I really do just collage it up. And um, some people, you know, they really, they make like fun, fo you know, <sighs> What am I trying to, what am I trying to say? This is going to have trouble sticking because it is glossy. I should have thought of that before I stuck it on here. I may have to come back with some other glue, but let's see. I'm going to take one of my, you're seeing more of my arms than you ever wanted to see too. Let's see if I can just, no, that won't do it. It's not big enough. Let me see if I can find my big one. <clears throat> If that'll clip it down a little bit. Maybe. I just may have to end up um, doing something else with that. But there it is. Alrighty. So what do you think? I've got to fill this corner. And, um, hmm. So you don't have to tear. You can cut. I just tend to tear. For me, it's part of my process that I like is just tearing. Um, I like the rough edges and and um, just seems more <laughs> organic. I don't, I don't know, but it just I I just like the way that works for me. It's just good. Oh, there's no more pink on that one. Let's see. Hmm, I may have run out of pink here, so let's see what's in here. Oh, Ooh. well, I think that might be, I'll have to fill in with some of the, um, some of the girls. Oh, here's some flowers. They're not pink, but they are pretty. I think we'll just go on, go on with that. Oh, you probably can't see a thing I'm doing. Ah, okay. I'm not sure about this overhead um, stuff, you guys. <laughs> I am not sure. Here we go. Here we go. Alrighty. So, I'm going to quit right now before, A, this is too long. And, and uh, what I would normally do is just kind of walk away from this a little bit. And then maybe find some other pink stuff and like come back and 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 fill in with like some pink color, um, just like maybe some of that, you know, just to cover up some of the white. But I'm gonna call it good for right this minute, and I will put um, on here somewhere that this is a swap and glue with um, Mimi or Melissa. Melissa is her name, and um, but Melissa da Davis. And it's Mimi with love. So thank you all. I hope this wasn't horrible and terrible. And you weren't totally uh, bored by it. 
<laughs> well, thank you so much. And I will get better at this overhead thing. All right. Bye now.